We're gonna throw down. Boom. Like that. Greenhouse well, as soon as he eats that, he's gonna get sanguined. Okay. Then boom, boom. Let's see what that does. And welcome back to Ark, where today, guys, we are going and taming up our gotchas. And yes, I have figured out what we need for them. Now, what I got here is I got me 80 greenhouse walls. Yes, that is a little expensive. It is, honestly, pricey. I basically used what was left of all my metal to get this. All right. What, what is left of my metal is probably going to be crafted up into the other greenhouse walls to tame the other gotcha. So, hopefully this thing only only needs 40. I'm about to cry because it's taking so much. Uh, I wonder. Here. Let's just go back through. Let's split them all. Half. I think they should give me 15 apiece. Okay, and then we got three sanguine elixirs on us. This one's a little old. It's the first one I crafted. It was originally going to be for my testing, but then I threw these down. I was like, oh god, that's not as much as my calculator said. So, luckily though, we are good. So what we are going to do here for the gotcha is, like always, I have my sort by set to life. I'm going to try and find the highest life one there. Okay. This one is a 150. How many 150s do we have on the map? Okay, we got three that we can check out today. And look at theirs. This one, though, looks like it has the highest life. I'm gonna go check him out. Or her, it's a girl. Okay. <clears throat> so, this place is not hard to navigate either. It's pretty easy to get around the underground pile. Or the underground forest, I guess is what it is. And I'm wondering if there are several pockets like this around the Earth, or if this is just because of this arc here, you know? There's a lot of gotchas in this one spot, oh my god. Okay, you- alright, it has 29. Would that be worth trying? I could try and tame this one. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna throw down, boom, like that. Okay, now, so as soon as he eats that, he's gonna get sanguined. Okay, then boom, boom. Let's see what that does. Alrighty, that actually worked. Hold up, how many did I use there? Oh my god, I still have a lot of walls. I can tame up another one. Okay. What did you come out as? 40! That's actually perfect! Uh, I I will say I'm good on health then. I need to find one of you guys with a good... What? What would be... Okay, hold up. Was that a crafting skill? Okay. So, I'm guessing that just like my, uh... Was it my helicopterion? The the like only major skill that he needs is this crafting skill. So I bet I have to go hunt for one that has a decent crafting skill. Okay, okay, let's get you cryoed up though, so I don't forget you. But you are health. That is a gotcha. That's actually really easy. Oh my god, it's unbelievably easy. Okay, hold up. What is our next ones here? Let's go with level. Um, let's go. Let's go check your stats. Okay, come on. What are you doing? Oh, it's fighting a raptor. Do I want to try and tame you? 
you only, you're see, I'm seeing stats and health is the problem. These things are expensive. Ah! Okay. Let's go check, let's go check a different one. That one had, that one has a high health. Um, let's go with the lowest one. How about that? Let's see what the lowest, one, lowest one's the furthest one. That's interesting. Okay, it looks like this dude's all the way over here on the other side of the island. There's the base there. Oh my god. Look at how big that island is compared to the base. Or the little outpost. It's not a base, it's an outpost. Just like a little place I can spawn for food and store diamonds. You know, just a safe place. Okay. What are your stats? I'm not seeing any high stats in anything, really. So I wonder if this guy would be worth taming just so that way... Damn it. Damn it. You prick. Why did you have to hit him? God damn it. Now I have to wait three minutes. Actually, I just gotta get out of render range. That was Raptor. And I'm pretty sure I just left behind ten walls. God damn it. I need... I need to go back. I need to go back. No, because those walls are too expensive to leave behind. Throw that down. God damn it, every time. Then where's my stuff? Okay. Are you still sad? Yeah, he's sad. Damn it, he won't eat. Okay, so I think he's happy now. We'll throw out that. We'll eat that. Oh damn it! Oh wait, 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 we're good. We're good. He tamed. He tamed. Okay. What are your stats? Okay, nothing really good there. Twenty-six crafting. What does it compare to this one? 28. Oh, I don't know what I'm doing here. Okay, but what I'm gonna do now is this. So these two gotchas will work. I guess I got one now I can just somewhat set up. I'm out of I'm out of walls. So I don't have anything to feed these guys. So Ah, uh, here, let me where's my no, give me. Thank you. Skyscraper base. Here we go. I'm going home. The game froze. This is scary. No! No! God damn it. I can't fix this. I'd have to, like, actually close the game. And... I got to. What? What happened? Oh, God. No. <laughs> Look at where it put us. We are back here. Oh, my God. It reset... 
I set us back this much. This much. For my helicopter on. Um, I'm probably gonna have to just run back there on the rock, Drake. Oh god. Okay, what we're gonna do is wait for you to sit down again. It looks weird on the side, you know? The, does it? The good corruption, I guess, is what it is. The techification of the dino. Okay. As soon as you see that seven available. Oh, I already gave him one. Okay. Okay, accept. Nice. Awesome. Let's pick that up. Mm, let's split this in half. Alright, so we still have 50 doors. So he ate 30. She ate 30. Okay. Did your stats come out the same again? No! No! I, lo mm, I lost my 40. Okay, I did it again. Damn it. Ready? Alrighty. Here we go. That fix it? It did. It did. Alright. So what I did is I doubled them up where I was dropping 20 at a time and that actually fixed the problem here. And fludge. Hey, this time I got a 41 in it. Nice. I'm gonna cry you up and go. Now, shoot. I don't know what to do for the other one. Sorry, didn't mean to push you there. Let's go and try and find it. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. I'm betting it's probably not there anymore. <laughs> Level... I think I went off the lowest one, right? This guy? Okay, so I got my two gotchas. And now we're gonna try and just run back up. Instead of teleporting. I don't know what would happen. It, like this entire day, like it's gonna be taming gotchas, and that actually went by pretty fast. So I thought, oh god, I'm gonna have another eight-minute video. And I got a feeling you guys much prefer the long, for longer videos, definitely, than these short ones. And which, yeah, I am kind of dragging this out more by actually running back and not like cutting. But yeah, anyways. Hopefully, though, we don't run into any problems in the desert. We should be able to breeze right through a lot of the corrupted dinos. Especially when all I'm pumping into this guy is stamina, mostly. Half the time. Okay. We just hit the loading zone. There. Okay. We might have to do, like, certain things here, like, uh... Maybe we can't leave Helicoprion out of a cryopod. Unless we're actually using him to get blueprints. You know, maybe that's how we. Uh, you, like you see, you see the problem I'm having right, right now with setting up a, some aquatic farms. Now, if I could find a spot here in the world with like actual, wa like I mean, yeah, I could go down there definitely. I could set up one there around the base. All right, hear me out. Maybe I could set up some aquatic farms there around the base, and we use or the one at the AB base to uh, do my aquatic farms and grinding. Because it seems like the skyscraper is like, too, too unstable, really, to do that. Because if I leave and then I try teleporting back, he dies. So I wonder if just like teleporting to the base will just kill everything there. Because the water loads in last, the creatures load in beforehand. hoping that I'm waiting for it if it happens this time I'm not gonna reset we're just gonna keep going with it because yeah I don't see reason how to start yet again because I just did it four times for a single gotcha 
just because the first time we got screwed out of a 40. And I also figured out, if you just drop down a bunch, like if you drop down 50 walls, or 40 walls all together, and then you pop the Sanguine almost immediately, it is basically a perfect 225 on my settings. All right, it's it counts almost like an insta tame, like it did for what, what are they called? Uh, the dodos, like anything, like all the small creatures that were insta tame, the passive ones, those guys all came out like that. And it might also be the sanguine elixir bug working because, uh, okay. sometimes when you uh finish off a creature with a sanguine elixir, it goes all the way to 225. And you get like a, one extra point. Is that an explorer note I have not gotten yet? I feel like I've gotten this one. Yeah, I have. But this is the scary part. Because I don't know what's going to happen once I get closer and that water loads in. I mean, hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm uh, not seeing anything saying Helicoprion died. Oh my god, it worked! Okay, he's he's still here. Okay. Sorry, I gotta get you over here to the landing pad. And Mr. Gunner just kind of does what he does. Right. He goes where he wants to go. I honestly have no clue what to do with this guy. Because he like... Alright. I had this problem at the ocean platform as well, where they just fly off sometimes. The Rhino Nanthia. But yeah. Um, what was I going to do? Oh, yes, 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 yes. That's what I was going to do. Oh, look at that. Look at that supply drop. Perfect. That's because that's what exactly what I'm about to go do. As soon as I get these guys out. Alright. Alright, so, I gotta show you guys something. Now, this guy right here, this is our health. Alright, and as you guys know, this time around, we got a 41 in it. And, well, I also, just doing those three things there, I figured out some bugs that we can do. So, we, again, these guys came out at 225. I don't know if it's part of this, uh, the sanguine bug that happens and all that, but yeah. 440, or 41 points into health. Now, here's the one I'm really excited about. Boom. Alright. Now, here's the good thing. Uh, gotcha should be happy as long as it's not two of them right next to each other that are, you know, the same gender. And that's how I think I'm going to have to use, do that platform over there. So, it's going to basically be like one side of the platform, I have a male, female, then the complete other side of the platform, male and female, then some snow owls in there and feeding them. But... I got 138 crafting skill in him. She only got 127. A booyah. I got one. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Now I need to go find where I put my reapers. Where did I throw my reapers at? Oh, yes, yes, yes. I know. I remember now. All right, so I'm going to go do some supply drops, and then I'll be back with you guys later. Or I'll get back with you guys later here. To go do the was it forest titan i only have enough to do one right now and we have to do the cave of course but yeah i'm gonna go do that do a couple more drops here hopefully i get a tech mech like i want 